Whoops. Oh dear. Hello, and welcome to What's for Dinner, where we cook dinner every single day in about half an hour. And it's an egg day today. Totally. I'm Ken Costick. And I'm Mary Jo Eustace, and Ken is absolutely right. You look really nice in your egg apron, and I'm sorry if anything happened there that well, shouldn't have um, happened. Well, uh, I think <laughs> what I shouldn't have done is put the egg in my... Pocket. I got, I got very carried away. Yeah. I wanted to touch you. It's all Something. that weight. Ouch. On egg Ouch. day, he slags Ouch. me. What the heck? What are you making, you my friend? You know what friend? I'm doing? I'm doing Ken's egg zucchini pie. Ooh. So if you want to grab a pan, I'll tell you what you require for the zucchini pie. Excellent. One tablespoon of olive oil, two cloves of garlic, minced, two large zucchini, one tablespoon of flour, six eggs, half a cup of finely shredded carrot, half a cup of cottage cheese, half a teaspoon of dried oregano, half a teaspoon of dried basil, half a teaspoon of mild curry powder, and that's optional. It is. And half a cup of shredded mozzarella cheese, and one quarter cup of grated parmesan. That's what I'm thinking today. Maybe. Now, do you want to know what I'm doing to what accompany doing your today? egg dish? Yeah. I'm doing something totally cool. I'm going to split the focaccio, Kenny, yeah. and I'm going to saute up some tomatoes with some basil, and then I'm going to make a sandwich and bake it in the oven. So, wow. baby, that's going to be good. Wow. And then I'm doing something with beans, which I'm very excited about. And if I have the time, I'm going to do an avocado and mango salad. So it's going to be very light. No soup. No soup. No do you feel soup okay today. about that? Yeah, well, that's fine. Yeah, that's, that's fine. fine. Sure. The, so the first thing I'm going to do is uh, saute my zucchini first. And get that done first. There, that's, thank that's you. for me for you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, because you're looking very... You gave me a gift. You're looking very cute today. Am I? Yeah. Must, must be because you're working with eggs or something. Maybe. I don't know. You look good. Maybe. You do. So I'm just going to slice up all my tomatoes. I always get very suspicious when you give me compliments. Why? Well, I don't know. I just... You think I, get... I want something? Yeah. Ah, no. Absolutely. Just you. Yeah. <laughs> just right. you. Now, what are you doing? I'm going to flour my zucchini. Excellent. Well, first chop it up. Yeah, that'd be good. In and, moons, baby. In moons. Yeah. And so like this, right? No, sweetie. No. Because that's a circle. Okay. That's a circle. Oh, I've got yeah, to cut yeah, it in yeah, half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got to cut it in half. Excellent. Okay. So I'm going to cut my zucchini in half because it'll cook quicker. True. This way. True enough. Now, did you know that I think zucchini is one of the lowest calorie foods on the planet? Did you know it that? Is. It's very yes. good for you. It's very low in calories and very high in vitamins. Right. So? It's a good idea. You know what zucchini? I do with zucchini uh, in the summertime is I grill it up. Oh, that yeah. would be good. On the barbecue. Awesome. Okay, I'm back at the pot center. And I'm just going to oh, grab... I know. Noise. I know. I'm just grabbing a pot and I'm going to do my... Um, I'm going to saute my tomatoes off in my wok. My right. wok -a Okay, so moons we're going to do like this. We're doing some moons. Like that, right? Yes. Right. Very nice. Very I just nice. want to check to make sure that you... Agreed with well, me. Well, I like that you look to me for approval. For once. Yeah, and I like to give it to you. Yeah. In you're return. feeling, you know, you're a very needy person. Oh, so, so needy. Oh, needy. Needy. You and me both, hon. Let's admit it. Kenny. Mm -hmm. Needy, I'm pretty baby. pretty self-confident, don't you think? Oh, I'd say. Yeah. Listen, if you wanted to, you could <laughs> substitute the cottage cheese with ricotta cheese for Kenny's dish. Might be a really nice substitution. Do you think there, sir? Now, just because I asked you a question doesn't mean you could do my substitution. I tips. did it. I just took it you for you. You just took it. You well, stole you... it right from under my nose. Well, you got those moons to worry about, and I know okay. you're really concentrating. I can oh, tell. Oh, I don't want to be mooning anyone. Oh, trust me. Definitely. Little S&P on my tomatoes. Okay to get these happening, and I'm going to split my avocado. Here, let's see if we have a bread knife. Now, you know what, Mary Jo? What, Kenny? I have to tell you, this zucchini pie that, that we're doing today, I do several different versions of this uh, type of uh, recipe. And I use, this is a good recipe when using eggs, to use leftovers. I sometimes do a turkey pie. Good idea, yeah. And I use an egg mixture. Excellent. With leftover turkey from Christmas time. Very good. Sometimes I do it with ham. Right on. I'm, I'm really very innovative when it comes you to are. eggs. You are. You are. You're using what you have in your kitchen. You're not freaking out. Nope. You're cracking an egg. Nope. And yep. throwing in whatever you got. That's right. Now I'm just going to split my focaccio here for a sandwich. This is one of my favorite things to do and as Kenny was saying, this would be great in the summer if you just wanted to grill up some vegetables sure. in your barbecue or, right. or in the winter in your indoor barbecue might be nice. 
that would be a good idea, don't you yeah. think? You know, sometimes uh, on Saturday mornings, I usually shop at a local supermarket, but on Saturday mornings After I go... After your cartoons. Yes. Yeah. I go to uh, a local market in the city here. Yeah. And I have... For, I do my shopping, and for lunch I have focaccia bread sandwich. Do you really? With roasted peppers <gasps> in it. Oh, that would be delicious. Well, yeah. I've got some um, uh, goat cheese today, so I think that'll be good, don't yeah. you? A little goat I cheese. Think so. Doing the inside with a little okay. olive oil. Boy, Excellent. you're working. I How wanna... did those get in there? Where was I? I don't know where you were. You were talking about the zucchini, the moons. Okay. And I'm just going to chop up some basil because I'm very excited about this um, this uh, dinner tonight. Yes. Honey? Is yes. the grill happening? Because I'm going to grill my focaccia before I put it in the oven. The grill is happening. Thanks, babe. Yes. Okay, I'm going to stroll over with my big hunks of bread. So behind. therefore, we're using an indoor grill today. You can you can uh, do this all year round. Totally. Yeah. Absolutely, sir. So, so I'm just going to throw a little basil in with my tomatoes, which will be good. Okay. Oh my. Now, after you do this, Kenny, you put this in the oven, right? That's right. And you, there's no crust, so it's very low in fat. Very low in fat. Excellent. Very. And if you wanted to, we're using olive oil, but you can use something like a canola oil uh, to saute in. Which would be good. Yeah. I I've, even, I've even done this without the flour. Get this. Oh, please. When I, I really want it very low fat in vegetable stock. That's, are you serious? Sauteed, yeah. Can I see a personal question? Pick me. Okay. Do you ever just work with egg whites? Sometimes. When you do omelets and stuff yeah, like sometimes. that? Yeah, sometimes. Because that would be very good in protein, but it would right. be quite low in fat because you wouldn't be using the yolk, which is a good thing. Well, I mean, every if you part of the cup, egg is pretty good, Every though. part of the egg yeah. is excellent, but yeah. I'm just saying you've got lots of options. Yeah. Lots of options. Okie dokie. I think in baking you have to... Uh, you have to do that. I don't do a lot of baking. No. My mom does, though. Your mom's uh, the yeah. queen of, of, of baked goods. Ooh, she, she's using lots of eggs. Yeah. How's Helen? Great. Yeah. She is so excited about coming on the show. I can't wait to see yeah. her. And she's not angry with me or, or anything like that. Like, I don't... Is she a little oh, angry she has a me? couple issues to discuss with you. Oh, dear. Again? Yeah. Uh, well, you know. Always. It, yeah, mm. yeah. Yeah, yeah. The pump let's, fits. Let, uh, talking pumps. Let's oh. just hope she doesn't wear those steel-toed really? army boots. Oh, yeah. gosh. I if hope not. If you see them coming your way, I'd run. I'm going to. Yeah. Now, I'm strolling over to our cupboard, and what I'm going to do, which I think is a really great idea, is I've got a seven-bean mix, a PC seven-bean mix. And I'm going to make my bean salad using this as a base, but I'm going to add some green pepper and some apple and celery and make it my own. You know what I do sometimes? What do, do, what do you do? I use this, add soup stock, oh, come puree on. it. Oh, come on. Stop. The Stop hits just it. keep coming. The hits just keep coming. Now listen you, you cute thing, you. My little egg <gasps> boy. Before we go sure. to the break, I have a little trivia question for my good friend Kenny. What? Just because I really, really like him. Kenny? Yes? Foodstuffs are used to describe many human characteristics or attributes. Name three. Now, I'm just going to give you um, an example. Mm. One is a real peach. Another I... one is like a lamb. Oh. Oh, do you see where I'm going with this? You know what? I don't even understand this clue. trivia question. Honey, I have no clue what you're, you're talking you're about. You're off the hook, baby. When okay. we get back from the break, we're talking eggs. Yeah. Welcome back to What's for Dinner, where we're having an egg day. Right, Kenny? We are. Absolutely. And what I've done here is I've got my focaccia bread, which I grilled, and my tomatoes, which I sautéed with a little basil and butter. And I'm going to proceed to make my sandwich. And I'm a bit embarrassed because I didn't get out the trivia question for Ken. I, I just, I blanked. And okay. Then... I have one for you. Since it's an egg day, I have a question. I have a trivia, and you're not going to get this. Oh, my gosh. In a year, approximately... How many eggs does a hen lay? <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> got excited there. You did. I got mm, really excited. I don't know, but 290, give or take 10, I'm not sure. You see this around there. That's okay. How did you know that? 280 to 300 in a year. Kenny, I know my eggs. You cheated somehow. I did not, but thanks for asking me. I liked it. You know what you get? What? A rooster. I'll take it. You know... I have a question for you. Uh-oh. 
And I wonder if you can answer this. Uh oh. You know, when they lay eggs. Right. Okay. okay. Well, I was never brought up on a farm. I, I'm, I wasn't I'm a city either. boy. Okay. So that's obvious. That's debatable. Okay. So. Yeah, uh, yeah, honey. Does the rooster have to do anything to to get them to lay the egg, or what? Well, what what's the action? Okay, well, like, do they have to procreate? Well, yeah. Well, you know what? Like, I don't know. I was thinking about that. Do you know? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe have, somebody out there knows. I have no idea. I, I don't know. That's I a would very think that they question. have to because. I'd like to think that they're in a monogamous relationship. They get to know each other, and then she has three hundred eggs per year. I'd like to think that way, wouldn't you? Well, yeah. Yeah, totally. Good question, Ken. Very good. Great minds think of like 350 in my oven. She goes for 20 minutes. I'm going to be using that oven also, too. Are you? For your yes, eggs? Yes, for my eggs. Is 350 Now, what I've done you, here... Sir? Is 350 a good temperature for you? It is. Okay, good. Yes. Excellent. What I've done here is I've uh, sautéed my zucchini. <laughs> Can you get that for and... me? Okay. Okay. Okay, just one second. Yeah, I don't know. Oh. Okay, so I'm just going to drain my beans over here. Okay. I've sautéed my zucchini, and I'm going to just remove them from the heat because I don't want them to uh, get too soggy. And I'm using one carrot here, one large uh, carrot, that I, I finely shredded. And the carrot acts as a binding agent in this pie. So if you wanted to, you could replace the carrot with something like um, <laughs> chopped broccoli. You got the snap there. Did you see that? Yeah, yeah, chopped broccoli or even cauliflower. Oh, that would be an excellent idea. Eh? That's very good. But if I use cauliflower, I would add another spice like maybe chili pepper or something. Excellent, just, sir. Just to add color to your dish. You want it to look nice. Like and this, the carrot is really going to make it look nice. Colorful. In goes the spices. I'm draining my beans. Okay. Like See how easy out. this is? This is just, this I'm is very, very easy. Over here, actually. And yeah. I'm going to add in the cottage cheese. Excellent. But I'm not going to add in the grated mozzarella and the grated uh, parmesan until later. I think that's a very good right. choice. And I'm going to show you how good I am with eggs. Go, baby. I can do it with one hand. Are you, you can do it with one hand? I, I always do it with one Let's hand. Let's see. Okay. Show watch. me. Watch this. Go. I'm an expert at this. You are. Oh, Look my at that. gosh. How did, how'd that make you feel? Very good. Hey, watch. Ve very Another good. One. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. What's, what's wrong, hon? What, what's wrong, dear? What did you do, Mary Jo? You gave me... What are you doing here? Pansy man can't even crack an egg. Can't even crack an egg. Pansy man. There we go. Look at that. You boiled some eggs, you little oh, brat. Oh, you little imp. I got you, didn't I, you Ken? You did, you did, you did, you did. Oh, gee whiz. Okay, I'm going to have to go get two more Let eggs. Let me get though. them for you. Okay. Brown or white, does it matter? Doesn't matter. In this recipe, it doesn't matter. There we go. Make sure these are... I'll okay. put three in. Okay, you'll put three in. Yeah. There you go. Okay, now what I'm doing is I'm chopping up my onions and uh, my celery and my green pepper and my apple for my bean salad. Right. And I drain my beans. I ran some water over my beans over there to Whoops. get rid of the toxins. And I'm going to get a bowl and put together my bean salad. I love beans. There, you I certainly said it. do. I totally do. Oh, geez, I'm bending over. Don't like that one bit. There we go. Okay. And as I said, this uh, pie recipe is an excellent, excellent recipe to use leftovers in your fridge, leftover meat. Yeah. You know what, Mary Jo? Yeah. I've even taken... Tuna fish? Tuna fish you know and you were gonna say crab. That? You know what? Yeah. I knew you were going to say that. Right? Is that weird? Uh -oh. And then that egg thing, we were both thinking the same thing about the hens. Like, do they uh -oh. have to get lucky to lay an egg? We weren't sure. No. Like, it's interesting, isn't it? I really want someone to write in and tell me that. Well, we can ask the egg lady when we see her. Yeah. Because I'm sure she'd tell us. Okay. In goes into a greased pie plate. Yeah. In goes the mixture. And on top, I'm going to place the pieces of zucchini. I'm going for the tip of the day, and it's a bit of a tough Oh! One. Do you want it? Do you I want it? I want to do it. Did you do the other tip? You stole sure, it right from I'm under sure my I, nose. I'm sure I did. Okay, then I better do this one. One grade A large egg contains only six grams of protein and only 75 calories. Very nice. There you go. So they're very good for you. Yes. Obviously. 
We used to have that. eggs a lot for dinner when I was a kid, like scrambled eggs and yeah. omelets and right? eggs and bacon. Do you know that 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 was, if you ask my mom when she comes on the show, right on. the first thing I ever cooked in my life for my parents serious? was fried eggs. Are you serious? Fried eggs and ketchup. How did you reach the stove? Oh, it was a, it was a did stretch. Did they put you on a little box, they just did. like we do now? They <laughs> That's so adorable. Oh. Ouch. Oh, ouch, Kenny, on egg day, I zinged you, babe. Okay, so in goes the Parmesan. Excellent. And I'm going to save some of the Parmesan for near the end, just to uh, give it that nice, crispy, uh, crispy look. Good. And I'm going to grate my mozzarella cheese, because buying it in a pound like this is a lot cheaper than buying it already grated. That's a very good point. Yes. Excellent. I'm going to be doing the viewer mail today. I'm very excited about that. Um, dear Mary, Joe, and Ken, I just wanted to write and tell you guys how much I enjoy watching your show. Every night, me and my little sister watch it and laugh so hard at all your joking around. I really like your show because I feel I can relate to the two of you. Since you're both so young and up to date. Oh, whoa, boy. She must whoa. get a fuzzy picture. Um, <laughs> she's a vegetarian and she's going to get married soon. One last thing, my boyfriend and I both agree on a traditional wedding, but they're not sure about the cake and she doesn't want a traditional cake. She wants something a bit different. Oh, yeah. You know what I think is excellent? Uh, huh? that's, a, that's a nice response to your coast. Uh, uh. I think a nice fruit flan would be nice. If it's a oh, summer wedding, yes. perhaps, or a trifle might be good. Yes. Do you have a suggestion, my dear friend, for well, Tara you know, Jane Anderson? Well, weddings are not my... Not your forte. No. Never, but... Never been married, have gone to lots. But you know what? i got to tell you something. Yeah. Uh, I know a lot of women who have gotten married. Right. And it is a lot of work for it's them. It's a lot of it's work. It's a lot of stress for them. It is a lot show. of stress. I've even known a couple people who didn't end up getting married because of the wedding. Like had a bit of a breakdown yeah. before the wedding? Major breakdown before the wedding. I was just so concerned that the groom was going to show up. That was like my big thing. Yeah, I would I, be concerned if I was I was here. very nervous about yeah. that, but... We it, were all surprised he showed up. Thank God he showed. Well, yeah. Like I said, you know, he, he knew a good find when he got one, I guess. I guess so. I guess that was it. Now listen, when we come back from the break, we might talk about weddings a bit more. I mean, ours here. On no, for no, dinner. we're not getting married. What? Why? It's Why not, couldn't no, this work? I no, think that this would work. It won't work. It won't work. Hello, and welcome back to What's for Dinner. I've just put in my egg pie, my zucchini egg pie, and I put it in at 350, and it's going to go in there for about 20 minutes. Excellent. But you know what you're going to have to do? No. Is we have to check it every so often to make sure that the egg mixture in this, uh, uh, what, what's the matter? Uh, what's in the center is cooking. I think your apron's a bit too high. You're what? a small man. That's not a good look for you. What? You don't, what? I, 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 you don't like the umpire I, waist I, I don't, situation? It's empire. I did the umpire. <laughs> you're in fashion. You should know that. I don't know if it works for you. No? I think it cuts you off a bit, baby. My height. Your height, because oh. you're six foot six, and you look six two. Yeah, exactly. Now, are you going to cube up those green peppers for me? Ex that's what I'm going to do hey, for you. Come on, e give me five. Exactly. Hey, look at I'm soaking my beans over here in my spare time because right? I've been very busy, and I drained out some of the hooey hooey, which I didn't want to go in my salad, and I'm going to put my beans in, and we've got our celery and our green pepper that we're going to add in our fresh dill, so that's going to be good. Aha! Uh -huh. I have another question for you. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, they're just flowing today. Go big. I don't know what's happening to I my head. I don't know either because it's disconcerting. How many days does it take for a chick to hatch? How many days does it take for a chick? Who, where'd you get that from? Who told you that? How many, it takes seven to ten? No. Uh, Twenty to thirty? I want exact days. Um, Twenty-four. Twenty-one. <laughs> got it wrong. What do I get? Nothing. What do you, what do you get? What do you, you want? You, what you, could I possibly give you that you don't have? Uh, I, don't, I do not want anything there. <laughs> Can he caustic? He's not very nice to me, is he, viewers? He doesn't realize the prize he has in Mary Jo Eustace. He just doesn't realize. I don't? No, you don't. Can you put my pepper in? Are you going to keep the pepper, baby? Yes, yes. I'm getting around to that. Okay, and I'm just going to put some balsamic vinegar and a little olive oil and S&P. So that's going to be right on. Mm-hmm. In front. Excuse me. I'm going to the oven to retrieve my focaccio sandwich that I did partly on Don't the Don't disturb my egg pie. I'm not going to touch your pie. Just check the center. See if it's cooking Kenny, well. Kenny, it looks... It's cooking evenly. Delicious. Yes. Look at this. Doesn't that look good? Ooh. And it's got the goat cheese melted inside of it. That's going to go really well. 
with our eggplant Yeah, well, today. it's a very nice dinner. Yep. Okay, I'm going to... Um, and the nice thing about that... That is, is it, cool. It's a family dinner. A family? You no, and well, I... Well, no. We're not going to be having a family. I have two children by a previous marriage you already. You sure do. Get... Right there. Okay, okay. And, okay. Ruby and Pearl. I know, and they're beautiful. Get yeah. your egg pie, because the viewers want to see your egg pie. Okay, okay. Egg yeah, pie. You've got, honey, you've got a snap. Ooh. Snap, crack, Anyways, and pop. I want to thank everybody for joining us today on What's for Dinner. Totally. Here we have my zucchini egg pie. And until the next time... Get in the kitchen and get cracking. Rattle yeah. those pots and pans and have a good time. Here, five. What, what, no way. Okay, go.